Okay, so in this tutorial, I'm going to show you how to deploy a Cloud God firewall on Azure using ARM template. All right, so well, so in, in order for you to do that, just log into Azure portal first. So when, when you're in Azure portal, um, on the left hand side, choose uh, create a resource. Okay, so in the search the marketplace box, just uh, type template deployment. Okay, and then choose the template deployment and click on create. Okay, and you know what you're going to do is you're just going to have to uh, build your own template in the editor. Right, so this is where you can add your parameters, variables, resources. Um, uh, what we're going to do is just choose load file. Okay. And you need to choose the main template of JSON. So where do we get this file? Um, so we need to download this template from our checkpoint GitHub repository. Okay, so for now, just choose, um, you know, open. Okay, so this is the checkpoints Cloud Guard repository, right? So uh, you just need to, you know, download the templates. We have a number of templates. Uh, for different kind of deployments like HA, single gateway, and VMSs. For my demo, I'll be just using the single gateway. All right, so let's go back to edit template. Okay, you can double check on the settings and you know parameters. Um, if everything is okay, just click on save. Okay, so that will bring you to this page, and you can still customize the template. You can edit the template, you can edit the parameters, and so on. Okay, and you know, what I'm going to do is, you know, change the parameters according to my requirement. So, let's, let me change the uh, region to South, Southeast Asia. Okay, I'll create a, a separate resource group, demo single gateway one. Okay, I'll take note of the name. Okay, and choose your Cloud Guard version. Okay, for me, I'm just going to choose R8040, PSU Go, and GTP. You can choose whatever, um, you know, version that, uh, you know, suits your requirement. Um, choose the password for admin. Okay, and just choose a fear name. I'm, I'm just going to use the same name as the resource group and specify a password for Siki. Okay, so this is where you can still, you know, customize uh, the network, a subnet and so on. So I'm just going to do a slight change here. Okay, just do. All right. And, um, most importantly, we need to uh, update this value, the artifact location, right? So we need to change, replace this value with the one that you find on our GitHub repository, the URL, right? So uh, we, we're just gonna replace it, okay? And, you know, click on review, validation passed now that the validation has been passed we can create um and go ahead with the deployment just go, go click on create okay now that we can see the deployment is in progress it's been in initialized and it is running so i'm what i'm going to do is i'm going to pause the video and come back once the deployment is completed. Okay, welcome back. Seems like our deployment is complete. Um, so we can um, go ahead and check the deployment uh, and, you know, we can check the resource group and, and you know, verify that the resource um, that have been created. Okay, and we can also 
uh, take a look at the VM as well. All right, there you go. We now have a new gateway um, that we have deployed using ARM template. Okay, that's about it. Thank you so much for watching.